lady here. You Ask said her. that you are a reformed she said, whore. Me. Look like you still got them them desires to be whoring around and indulging in some sodomy. If it is true, hey, do what you want. It's no fugazi. Keep it funky, but don't contradict yourself, baby girl. Wait, You're so the like, hypocrite now. Got it. Let her explain. How am I a hypocrite? What does she have to do with it? It's her, oh, not fuck. her. Hey, 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 what is the worst experience you've had in dating? Whether it could be like in the talking stage or um, dating apps. Like what is a bad experience you've had in dating that made you feel like, you know what? I, maybe I should just take a break from dating guys. Start with you. Okay, honestly, when I first turned 18, I dated this boy. He was very rich. Like his family was like police, like all this crazy stuff. And our relationship ended up being very toxic. I'm not going to lie. I really only dated him because he drove a black Range Rover, and that was my dream car. <laughs> but, you know, like, then it started to get very toxic. Then we started, like, fist fighting each other. So you dated him only because he drove a black Range Rover? Honestly, I'm not going to lie. That's what got me. And then I'm like, okay, like, we could find out. You Pause, know? chat. Y'all <laughs> see what she just... <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I love a black Hey, uh, chat, man, you work on yourself. You get nice things. Yeah. You gonna be able to get in between. I'll just mess with you. But okay. finish. Go ahead. Yeah. What's your crazy story? But, so yeah. So then we would like fist fight and stuff. And then long story story short, like his parents called the police. And then even though like it was crazy because he like choked me like with his arms around my neck and like his chest on my face everything. But then I bit him because I'm like my ears was ringing. I'm like damn I'm finna. Die. So but then the police came and then they ended up arresting me. I went to jail and I'm like there's no way on wow, God, you went God's green earth right now that this is my reality. And I'm like And this was the first day you met him? No, 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 no. This oh. was like this was like 3 months into our relationship at this point. Okay. And and, soon, and you were really only with him cuz of the black Range Rover. Yeah, and then it was also oh, crazy too. We ended up also being in an open relationship except it was like not really an open relationship. There was like a third it was like a throuple. And the third person was a man, and then I had to break that off because man, he was hold up. So you was in a thru thruple. Yes, and the third person was a man. So he's bisexual. I think so. He denies it, but like you were definitely he like making again. out with that man and like sucking yeah, his tongue you know, down your throat. School, like you're definitely a little gay. No spikes. side conversations, ladies. No, because she's farting again. Wait, like, what happened? Silently farting next to me. You I don't even want to sit here because you keep doing this. I just don't even understand. Okay, she farted. She um, farted again. All right. And uh, it yeah. Can you it really please hold your gas? What's her name? You said he was going to go to the bathroom. Genesis. Like, it's really disgusting at this point. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm so Genesis, can you please hold your gas? Mm hmm. That's what you said last time. You are <laughs> can, nasty can, for this. Uh, someone, Steve, we got Pepto Bismol for her. Maybe it give her a Pepto. It smells bad. Or like, I don't even know what you ate for real. That's. Yeah, we might have some time. Yeah, I, I don't smell anything I'm right now, but if I smell oh, anything... Who's next to her? Who's sitting next to her? We got the rules for everything. I'm just my slow ass. Well, I don't smell nothing now, but yeah, dang. I don't smell anything uh, either. Okay. Wait, was it again? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Ain't no way. <laughs> girl. <laughs> There's no girl code in here. We're ladies. Present yourself as one. All right, okay. It's not everything uh, yours. <laughs> not we do it live. This is crazy, <laughs> chat. <laughs> Uh, Shorty in here farting. <laughs> this is wild. Uh, okay. Uh, let's finish up your story. So you said that That's you were I'm... in a relationship with a man for three months. He was, he you enough. only liked him because of the black Range Rover. Also, it was a thruple, meaning that you brung in another guy. and He, he brought used, in the other man. He brought, he brought, in, he brought in the other man. And all of you three used to do things. So what's the climax of of this story where does, does the crazy more crazy stuff happen oh yeah because like like i would just be trying to like be with my man because we both agreed like okay even though it's like a third like he's like the side type but it got to the point of like he's literally pushing me off his lap to like make out with this other man like is making me work late to work because he just wants to like suck on this dude's face all day but he he swears to god he's not gay well, but like well, friend you're definitely I mean, gay he so is gay he he's has gay. To, that's so the definite made, listen yeah, listen baby girl like i'll make it clear to you <laughs> that's the definition of gay that, he's gay that's what i thought too but like <laughs> okay apparently i got that up, huh? He was okay with it. Of course, she was At doing it. At first, I was stuff. okay with it because I I liked the 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 other boy a little bit. But like then, once I started seeing like oh like y'all are really just like like gay for each other, like y'all don't even give a f about me. I was. Well, I got a question. Did they both smash you? 
No, we actually, I never had sex with both of them, but... You mean at the same time? He, no, I, n I never had sex with the one dude. Like, I thought that he, the, the third guy, he was very third, fine wait, to wait, me. Wait, there's three guys? Yeah, no, 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 wait, no, 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 no. Like, many? like, I'm the first, he's the second, and the dude is the third type shit. So it's oh. like me and just me Oh, you mean dudes. the second dude? Yeah, you never the second did guy, yeah, yeah. Okay. But so, I thought that he was very fine and sexy and everything, but he was actually gay, like, fully gay, like, not even bisexual, but, like, I just, like, low-key wanted to him so bad i'm not even gonna lie so that's why i was like okay like yaki in the middle of this okay so but we never here, did have sex though here's what we're gonna do because uh artichoke. the crazy story but um the other girl doesn't want to sit by her because she was farting she can sit right, she can sit right here yeah. um yeah let us sit let us sit over here i do want to sit over here because you keep farting and i don't, I don't sure know. yeah sure. We, we got we'll switch you your need seat a microphone or something yeah, that we sounds got good you. y'all smell that that's in body work. That that's always you comes in handy. I am not switching. I got you. Let's go ahead and put this over here. Y'all are still live in this moment? Yeah, we live right now. Oh, my God. Uh, you can sit down right now. You know, Papa John's be extra cheesy. We do this live. Holy spirit. What you eating? All right, take a seat back. Smack. Right. Is that fish? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Hey, Mike, Mike. <laughs> I'm crying. Uh, hey, chat. We do it live. We got a stinky girl on the podcast. She ain't here farting, scaring <laughs> other girls. <laughs> This is wild, but uh, who recruited her? Ease, was this you're yeah, doing? Yeah. yeah, yeah, I did. God I did. dang, Ease, what's going on with you, man? Uh, it's all good, man. We do it live. All right, um, chat. <laughs> Sorry about that. Okay, ladies. All right, so you were telling your crazy story. The conclusion of your story was that you were with the with one man. He brought in another man. He was real gay for that other man. So that's why you kind of broke up with him. Mm -hmm. That's no, but you. then we I ended up going to jail though from that same man because we were fighting. Okay, so you went so to jail because you like, bit him, right? Yeah, but he choked me first. So I don't really feel wrong for that. I'm not gonna lie. Got you. I but, why didn't the cops arrest him? Mm -hmm. Because it's crazy because we were in the small ass town and then the state troopers showed up and his uncle was the state trooper oh, and that was the cop that arrested me and brought me through you know like this happened to me right off the wake up they didn't even let me put on pants like i stood in front of the judge in no pants like it was crazy no panties either yeah. no i had on, i had on a little underwear situation but and a little big t-shirt but no pants no nothing just vibes but just, yeah just vibes <laughs> just vibes praise the lord <laughs> okay i see um all right let's go with you um let's go with your question so, so the your question most craziest is, story yeah your most craziest dating experience yeah I mean, you only been single for like what a <laughs> year, so I probably hasn't been. But what about okay? Since since that's the case, what about like with getting to know a guy, whether it's through dating apps or meeting a guy out and about? Like, what's something odd or uncomfortable that you experienced with the opposite sex? Um, I went on a date with this guy. I found that he, I thought he was really cute. I thought he was really cute. Um. So I went on a date with him, but I, I kind of ghosted him a little bit before because his conversation through text and call was very boring. And I don't like boring people. <laughs> so I ghosted him. And then he kept DMing me, kept DMing me. And then he ended up, you know, finally convinced me to go on a date with him. I had never met him at this point. So this is my Ooh, first time meeting him. Nothing. Girl, don't even start. So anyway. <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> anyway. Continue. So where was I? Honestly, she threw you, me the fuck off. You, uh, the guy, um, he was in your DMs because his conversation we was We finally boring. go on a date. We go to the date on the at a really nice place. It was a cute restaurant. Um, but he was just, he was very awkward and couldn't hold a conversation. So I almost felt uncomfortable being there with him. But I usually stay with a backup plan. Like I usually make some <laughs> up or have somebody call me to get me out of these type of situations. But after him, because he was so awkward and I didn't enjoy being around him. I just kind of stopped going on. What was awkward like about yeah. what was what he awkward was, thing that he did that he did? He let silence go on for a very long oh, time. Oh, yeah, that is awkward. It okay. was so yeah. awkward. He couldn't really hold a conversation. He couldn't. And stuff like he that. Couldn't. So that's your worst like dating awkward. experience. I would say yeah. In the past year, that was very uncomfortable for me. I wish you understood how long this date was for you to. <laughs> this was like four hours long. The date was four um, hours long. Yeah, I would. Yeah, he just um, would ask me questions, and I could talk my ass off i could talk all day so but eventually i felt like okay you're not really saying anything or maybe he was just genuinely a boring person mm. so how did you escape from that date um i had backup plans what was the backup my best friend we did a game called night you. at her friend she, 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 she called you and said hey look um i need you to come I to an emergency <laughs> yeah. i did that before okay yeah okay yeah. got to go <laughs> so. okay all right cool. 
Uh, what about you? Uh, craziest dating experience? Um, I'm not like you know gonna date like you know person to person, but like I was in a dating app for like a probably like a month and a half or two months. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, I think the craziest thing was a guy asking me to go out with him, but like to he wanted me. He said that he wanted me to you know mess around with other men, but he wanted to watch me. Dude, I was like, oh, he was a cuck. Oh, he was like, a cuck. Okay. Yeah, I was like, wow. I, was like, I come off right away, and you know, once I feel like a weird energy, just cut off. What the hell? Gotcha. Yeah, yeah, I would love that. Like, I'm like, yeah, I'm all like, you know, like. So that was the weird. That was like one date with the guy. No, no it was. It was talking it was to the dude like off the dating app. Like through a dating app. Dating that's app. It. So y'all never even like hung no, out. No, he was just you know kind of like hey like i want you to you know do stuff with other men and okay. i love to watch i and watch and so and i'm just like yeah no that's not got you got you <laughs> that's it, that's yeah that's a little weird um <laughs> moving right along uh genesis what about you craziest dating experience well the greatest dating experience i've ever had is uh, when cr- i was crazy. inside you know, the church like, like, you know, like the bad one like a crazy can you let me finish one. i was inside of a methodist church and this nigglet took his shirt off and basically in the middle of the temple, the temple is where I had sex. I don't think nigglet is a word you should be using, ma'am. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. Stop, stop, stop. All right, so you had sex with a man in church and you claim that you are a holy woman? That's exactly what I said. The Methodist church. By the way, Harriet Wait, Tubman. Wait, did you write was, this down? Yeah, I wrote it down. Oh, is that your like your little note, your little journal? Oh, absolutely, for I all write of it your down. Craziest things. Were you traumatized from this experience? Was I traumatized? No, I was not traumatized. I actually learned how to have peace in Christ from that sexual experience in church. Basically, do you know what a Methodist is and a Baptist is? Do you know what a what a Reformed Puritan is? Do you know what what it's like? Really? You did Are you a reformed Puritan? That's exactly what I am. When when did you become <laughs> reformed after you had sex or before you had sex in a church? So we're dealing with intimacy, huh? Let me tell you something. Okay. Affection, that's a really, really personal issue for me. Okay? okay. So I'm not going to sit here in the middle of this stupid YouTube live platform okay. and expose who I'm having intimacy with. We didn't ask you to do that. Oh, you I swear. already did. Please, you just said you please. let someone clap cheeks in the church. You just said Sincere Cruz was clapping cheeks and didn't want to marry you. You've exposed all this stuff all this stuff yourself. Uh-huh. What are you talking about? Historically, I'm talking about me having intimacy in the inner most holy of holies. So at the end of the day, what you see is Moses, and he's somehow connected to Jethro and Aaron. Okay. Wait, what? So what? <laughs> what does this have to do with anything? What are you talking about? Do this, you really want to have this argument right now? It's not argument. I'm asking you a question. Go so ahead. Go I ask you a question. You said that you are a reformed whore, meaning that you don't <laughs> have sex anymore like that. I'm asking you, when did you become a reformed whore? After or before you got your cheeks clapped in church? I'm going to say after. Uh. <laughs> I'm not surprised. <laughs> I'm not surprised. Okay. So Honestly. after you got your cheeks clapped in church, is that when you started the relationship with Sincere or before? No, actually, it was before I was with S.A.U., the Sasquatch. What? Speaking it's of a Mike. Sasquatch. Me, I don't know what that is. So you don't know who S.A.U. is? Mm. No. I know who Suhu. I'm from Jersey. That's what we do. Suhu. That's uh, about all I know. <laughs> your turn to talk. Okay. <laughs> okay. So that's your crazy story. Someone clapped cheeks in the church. A chat. We do it live. I don't know where this creature came from, but y'all getting it today. <laughs> this is not made up. This is literally. <laughs> Quite literally. She came in a studio like this with this book with oh, that head really? on and them glasses. This isn't planned, bro. Um. Let's move it on to you, Jasmine. Okay. Craziest dating, uh, dating experience. experience. Um, like you gotta elaborate. Like somebody I was with, or somebody I just like Either was or. talking to. Talking. Which what's your craziest? craziest. Which one craziest? All right. Um, matter of fact, I could. Um, before I got with the guy I'm with now, um, I was with some a guy, and I tried to like, cause at 
the beginning, I was dating two men. I was trying to figure out. No, you, wait, they, you were dating two men, and did they know about one another? Oh yeah, I was totally honest. They no. both knew. Oh, and they accepted that. Like they were mm, like, yeah, that's my no. girl. I didn't claim no. None of us claimed each. Oh, no one claimed each other. No, Meaning no, no. that you were in a dating stage. I was just thinking and... of dating. I was like, um, ma'am, it's okay. See, touch. No yeah. touching. Hey, uh, Genesis. Please smack no, me. No, no touching, no guess. Why would I? I don't hit females. Yeah, Genesis. No touching, nobody. Please, See please you don't lie. put your hands on the guests, or we got to remove you off the podcast. <laughs> Very similar today. Don't do that. Yeah. No, I'm kidding. No, um. Hold on. But when you say dating, what does that mean? Like just going on dates and talking, no, or talk- like having sex, or. Yeah, both of them. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Right. I was outside. I was outside. I was in my little prime. I was okay. mid twenties. Okay. So I was like, I was. Good, dating you know both that's of them. your prime. That that was my prime, and I'm done. I'm gonna be thirty this month. I'm okay, done. Okay, fair enough. So um, yeah, I was dating both of them. They both they didn't know who they were, but they knew like, okay, she's talking to somebody else. But um, I got pregnant. And then I was like, well, it's not his because I stopped talking to him for m- two months already. Okay. So then um, once he realized, like, damn, she's really not talking to me no more, he went to my house, popped all four of my tires, then went to my parents' house and popped three of my dad's tires. Wow. Um, you had homie salty like that. And now he's nuts. I still have a PFA on him. Um, he would. He came to my house, knocked on my door. Kicked my try to kick my door open. Had to call the cops on him. And to this day, he's st- it's three years later, almost four, and he's still to this day like does not leave me alone. And I have a whole PFA on him. Damn. Okay. Yeah. That's 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 pretty that crazy. Is crazy. That is uh, crazy. Everyone that's tuned in on Facebook, we are currently live. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and close down a Facebook stream now. Everyone, Hallelujah. come on over to YouTube. Um, it's gonna get more crazy close. on this podcast. We got Genesis. She got the the cat thing on her head. Um, it's a lot of crazy stuff going on. So come on, it ain't it's safe sweating. for Facebook. <laughs> Please come on over to YouTube. That's No Fugazi Podcast on YouTube. Come on over now. We closing down a Facebook stream. I like being warm year round. Okay, I was born in California where it's warm year round. I like my sackcloth at the end of the day. I have, I have. Wait, wait. I have to say something. You told me you was born in Ecuador. No, I was born and you raised you in California. My parents are Guatemalan. You told me you were an immigrant. Remember? We had this conversation. Okay. Uh, well, I mean, any conversations I had off camera, let's just keep it off camera. She says she's from Cali, so let's just Let's just with. leave she's it from, at that. Let's just leave it at that. Um, thank you, detective. I didn't know, but I guess you knew mm-hmm. something I didn't know. Anyway. All right. Uh, let's get... Uh, ladies, do you have any questions? Fine. Okay, you have a question? No, not yet. <laughs> I mean, you can get to your question now because since we got time. Want to go ahead and ask it? Go ahead. No, I don't think I should. Let's just wait. Ask the question. No, go fine, ahead and ask your question. Fine, yeah, fine, Ask the question. Okay, I have a question because... Wait, 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 real quick. Um, no eating on a, on a podcast. Where did you get all this candy from? What the heck? She pulling out snacks out of her butt? <laughs> snacks out of that head? Damn, she pulling out one. snacks out of everywhere. Dang, the, the snack monster. What you, a cookie monster over there? She got all the snacks. Shorty pulled out a snack from her glasses. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Man, we should zoom in on them Jordans. I think some snacks came out of there. <laughs> them Jordans leaning, y'all. Wait, time I'm putting the camera on the Jordans. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold it's like, hey, we do it live. We do it live, Jack. All right, let me stop wowing. But anyways, um, go ahead and ask your question. It, can I direct it to a person? Yeah, yeah. You or can, is it like, it could be in general. Okay. Whatever, yeah, yeah. Do whatever you want, Jasmine. Take the floor. Yeah, you can do whatever you I want. Know. Go ahead. It's only, it's, it was a question for her. Because I felt like you was like trying to hit on her. What's your name again? My name is Ellie. Okay, yeah, you were trying to hit on uh, can Ellie. Can you just speak in the mic this way? Yeah. I felt like you were like trying to hit on Ellie. And I don't know if I heard it right. You was asking for a kiss in the hallway. I don't know if, it, if I was bugging. I could be. Like, yeah, I'd be hearing shit, you know? So, I w- I'm, what I'm trying to ask, because I did hear that you be getting your cheek slapped, too. So, I want to know, are you, like, both ways? I, first of all, I want to correct you, because I told her directly, Ellie, that mm-hmm. I wanted to kiss her forehead and not her lips. Very yeah, but that's strange. that's strange. Who asked that? She just met me. They're questions at the end of the day. And I said, Yeah, but that's what I'm asking. Like, do you go both ways? 
It's just like a small question. You just, yes, Are no. you bisexual? Cause I used to be bisexual. Mm-hmm. Okay. But do you okay. still find women attractive? Of course I find women attractive. There's a bunch of pussy in the room. Why wouldn't I? Lord. Okay. Now, it's do you think that's a vagina. holy thing? Do you think that being bisexual is in the Bible? Don't you understand that that's sodomy? That's of the devil and Actually, not of God? Actually, Leviticus chapter 18 talks a lot about intimacy, doesn't it? Leviticus chapter 18, it's a chapter. Okay. You're saying so, that sodomy is a good thing? Why don't you look it up? Leviticus 18, it says that it's the I, same thing I, as sleeping with an animal. So if you're gay and you're sleeping with an same. animal, God is going to what? He's going to hate it. Exactly. So this be. attraction that you have for women, you're on the podcast. I guess he's invited her here. And you're, <laughs> <laughs> you're Bestiality. asking other women to kiss you on the forehead. Look. <laughs> Homosexuality the, is the same and equivalent yeah. as bestiality. So why would I like that? But you, you, you're saying that you used to like it and you still have an attraction for women. So obviously you still desire it. You're the one with the notepad with all the Bible verses. So I'm just asking you. <laughs> Seems ask, like you're contradicting yourself. Remember, ask you this said young that lady here. You ask said her. that you are a reformed whore. Who? Look like you still got them them desires to be whoring around and indulging in some sodomy. If it is true, hey, do what you want. It's no fugazi. Keep it funky, but don't contradict yourself, baby girl. Wait, You're so the like, hypocrite now. Got it. Let her explain. How am I a hypocrite? What does she have to do with it? It's her, oh, not fuck. her. Yeah, hey, 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 Knocking stuff over. <laughs> well, can I sit my phone Get her up out of here, yo. No, 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 no. Get her up out of here. Hi, I'm out of here. Get out of here. Fuck that. Can I sit on that side? Yeah, you can sit. Yeah, you can sit. Damn, where's my caption marker? Oh, my God. And we do this live. Please talk to the camera. Dan, put it on uh, East. She knocked everybody in the cross off. <laughs> Steve, make sure she all the way out, bro. Yeah, make sure she okay. all the way out, man. She knocking stuff over, knocked over the mic. Uh, adjust Is this she camera. banging on the door? The main camera? That whole thing, like... Uh, and put the light over, fix the light. You can just, the top of it. Yeah, that's good. Is she, did you lock the door? Yeah, 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 we locked it. Yeah, she yeah. out of here, bro. Yeah. Yeah, that shit crazy. Hey, uh, so chat, mean. we do a live and ease. Yeah, bro, you can't invite Jones like that on a podcast, bro. I didn't know she was like, my yeah, first nigga, time meeting her today. Nigga, ease, that is a L, my nigga. <laughs> it was my first time meeting her today. I didn't know she was going to be like that. You said you invited her on purpose, so what was the purpose? Because she said she thinks that she's going to escape. She, she doesn't think that she's going to um, experience death. She thinks God's going to come down and bring it to heaven. She's just not going to experience death. So, I'm like, oh, so you know she was already on that godly stuff. You know yeah, I did. I did. I definitely did. <laughs> this was his first time meeting her, though. No, it was did. my first time meeting her. Yeah, seriously, he, though. I I don't think he expected this. I didn't, yeah. Thank did you, you actually I, 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 No, this? I did not. On, 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 on Wilson, no, I did not. I did not. I did yeah. think she was a little off. <laughs> but I think she was going to do this. I don't yeah, know yeah. the girl. Like, she hit me up. So, yeah. No. <laughs> okay, talk about that story. She hit you up. Explain. Okay. All right, all right. So, um, she added me on Facebook. And then, um, and then we, and, um, we, we started messaging or whatever. And then I'm like... Yo, I'm like, yo, look, I don't... So she was trying to holler at you. Right, 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 right. right. Oh. Okay, okay. So like, I'm, like, yo, look, I'm like, yo, look, I don't I don't like the way you dress. You Freaky. know what I'm saying? Like, if, if we're going to hang out, I said, if you're going to hang out, you're going to have to dress like a girl. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't like I don't like this this tomboy stuff. You know what I'm saying? And um, So you was finna give her a little chance? Yeah, like, she, she, cause she, on, on her Facebook, she has pictures of her... Dr- Matter of fact, should... On her Facebook, you saying that she was I right? I need to see. I need to see some. No, 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 <laughs> no, because I think you need to show everybody this picture. You need to show everybody this picture. I blocked her. I just took off. No, don't lie now. Yes. No, I really did yeah. block her. Like, I blocked her. No, we need to. Well, then let us know the Facebook name at the end. Uh, it's, it's, I got you. But no, yeah. no, 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 I'm going to need to find out. out. <laughs> She's like, I'm going to get dolled up. She, you know what I mean? She, has, she got on Facebook. She has oh, a picture she of her in a bikini. <laughs> on, on a, on a Facebook. <laughs> she, got her, she got herself in a bikini. Matter of fact, who's that? Did I show you? It was a Mel. Could have been. You want show Mel? Look up. <laughs> <laughs> but no, and I was like, yo, look, like, and she was just talking about, all right, yeah, I'm going to get the dog that we're going to hang out. Yeah. 
You know what I'm saying? I said, I just don't trust like that. That's not what I like. You know what I'm saying? So I said, all right. <laughs> but, we, but we didn't end up hanging out because, you know what I mean? Like, she ended up going somewhere. And then I, and then, um, I was like, you know, yo, just come just come onto the podcast. You can meet me there. We could, you could talk about God and all this other stuff. You want to talk about yourself? Okay, so that's the only thing you knew. Like, she was like, that's the religious whole, yeah that's all like I knew that. because when we spoke all she talked about was God the oh, entire okay. time and facts, she talked about oh I want to get married and I'm saving myself I'm not going to have sex until I so, get married so and what what would have happened if you would have actually went out on a, on a date with her bro that what you just <laughs> saw like, that's probably what it would have happened because I never nigga I taught you about FaceTime you FaceTime with the shorty she doesn't, so have, you know, she, she doesn't have a phone she doesn't have a job oh, she a red flag wait no no, no I thought she did have a phone because she was upset about, she about did have her a phone. phone she had an Android. Yeah, but no, that's not what she told me. She told me like she doesn't have a home. She doesn't have a cell phone. She called me. Dude, she got her. a home. Yeah, she got she a home. Homeless. So look, look, she doesn't have a. She doesn't have a cell phone. <laughs> I think that's about her mom's. She doesn't have a job. Um, she's oh, she's on probation for theft. And you let her. And you like the this girl? Of her phone? Yeah. I didn't say I like her. He's. No, you said no. you were willing to like get to know her. her oh, yeah, because I went to smash. Yeah. Fine, no. Check out but her I didn't know how to smash. You can't yeah. smash yeah. every picture. picture. You know what? That should be a conversation. No. You cannot yeah. smash every picture. Every picture. Yeah. But is it yeah. the right one? I seen a picture of her in a bikini. See, but that's picture. definitely a conversation we need to have because you cannot smash everything. Not everything is smashable. I, well, I didn't smash it. You wanted to though. A little no, bit. I saw the bikini. Come on, bit. Yo, y'all see the bikini it's picture. Like you, you bikini. It don't matter. We was. <laughs> He don't even care about what Yo, was in. He just cares about it all, bro. <laughs> wow. Yeah, that's that's on, bro. Is They're down definitely down coming now. at you with the comments. I hope they are. <laughs> yeah. I, I want to hear those comments. <laughs> <laughs> I want to hear those comments. Yo, let's move it on. Hey, 